this is where boundaries come in, right? So is your goal and going to speak with that loved one? Let's say it is closure. What's the definition of closure for you? And what portion of that closure is contingent upon you? What portion of that closure is contingent upon what that person does? And is there somewhere to meet in the middle? Because sometimes I watch your TikTok videos all the time, Dr. Joseph. And if you have a parent, like I, I, I listen to you talk about scarcity mindset, right? And so if you have a parent who's like, don't you throw them plastic bags out, <laughs> right? And you still like, no, 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 we're going to recycle because it's the right thing to do. But they don't understand recycling. They just know hoard the bags under the sink. Like we all, all black folks. I think all of us have that cabinet okay. where you hoard them plastic bags. <laughs> I still have them at the house right now. <laughs> do you know what I'm saying? And you, so the idea is if they want you to keep those bags and that's what's going to keep the peace and it's not going to hurt your soul, keep the bags. Like that might not be the place where you're going to get closure, you know, so to make it like a little more serious, if you've been hurt by someone, whether it's physically, emotionally, financially, whatever it is, and it's a loved one and you're seeking closure, I try to tell people you may not get closure based on that person's response to you. Because just because you've grown and you're in a place where you're ready for closure, that doesn't mean they are. And so what I try to encourage people is to really be clear about sometimes closure is you need to say what you need to say. Like Nene said, I said what I said, right? You need to say that to the person, you need to get it out. And that's as much as you're gonna get at this stage of your closure. So if your closure is contingent upon that other person changing their behavior, apologizing, do you know what I mean? Asking for your forgiveness, you might not get that. So I don't, I always try to encourage people, don't set yourself up for that. Be clear about you have something you need to say. You have something you need to unpack. And all you're asking for from that loved one in that moment is can you please just listen? 